I've heard that you've settled down, that you've found a store and you're saving now. I heard that your deals worked out, guess they came to you. And you got them items. I don't know how the rest of this song goes. But hi guys, it's Jacob from the New England Coupon Character, and I'm back with another CVS haul. I was gone for about a month, but I am back. My extra bucks were expiring in a couple of days, and I had a little bit of time this weekend. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go to CVS. I'm going to make them a Sunday video. Well, it's a Sunday night upload video, but it's a Sunday video at least. And I can show you guys what I picked up at Dollar I was about to say Dollar Tree, at CVS this week. This is Dollar Tree. That's from last week. I just put that there because I'm too lazy to put them away at the moment. However, excluding those items, all the other things, retail value would have been $379.37. Right? $379.37. Ridiculous. Out of pocket, I paid $27.24. Not usually what I like to pay, especially because this is CVS, and we can do a lot better than that. However, I went in with $78.50 in extra bucks. I used a total of three cards today. However, after um, my purchases, I got back $110 in extra bucks, right? Because that's a huge gain. So, all in all, combining my out-of-pocket with the net gain of my extra bucks, it was a total of four dollars and twenty six cents money maker right can we say that? money maker like i said on this channel before i cannot sing however it's fun to sing about coupons you know say it with me money make okay i'm gonna stop there so it's already been two minutes we're gonna get into the deals um it's a pretty good week going into this week i was like oh no this week sucks i have i have to burn my extra bucks that i have i have to you know use them all roll them all and i was like what am i gonna roll them all because this week sucks but praise the Lord, Jesus Christ, or whoever you believe in, I got a 30% email coupon on a card that has never gotten email coupons in the past three years, at least, over three years. As well, I got a 20% coupon ailed, mailed to me, ailed, who am I? Mailed to me, this was on a different card, and I got a 10 off of 40. I didn't use the 10 off of 40, though, because that card, I didn't have any extra bucks, but it was good, you know, that at least I got it. So I went in with a 30% on one card and a 20% on another card. So that's why I was able to, you know, score the money makers. Obviously, you're not everyone's going to have the percent off coupons. I was very lucky this time. I have no idea why I ended up getting them this time. But um, that's going to be YMMV. So that's enough talking. Let's get into the deals because I know that's what everyone's here for. Okay, so the Gillette Mach 3, I did two different scenarios on these, so I used two different cards to do this deal. On one card, I picked up three at $8.99. I used three $3 manufacturer coupons from the P&G, as well as a five off of 25 Gillette or Venus Razors coupon, and then I had a 30% off on this card that I was using it on, so it came to $4.87 and I got back the 10 making it a $5.13 moneymaker, so that's awesome. I just want to let you guys know if you were doing the math and you're like, Jacob, you got a lot of money makers. Why was it such a small one for you, you know, out of all after you calculate everything? And the reason is because I used beauty bucks. I used force printed ECBs. I used different CRTs and stuff, which kind of messes up your percent off coupons. I'm not exactly sure 100% how that works. So I don't want to, you know, say what I believe because then I might be wrong. So if anyone has been couponing for a while or really knows how to work with those percent off coupons, because I have not gotten a percent off coupon, like I said, for years. So um, if you know about that, let me know and we can have a discussion in the comments. I'll give you a shout out whenever I make my next video, if you know about that, um, because that's going to be really important if you get those, because I planned on my out of pocket being a lot lower than it actually was by about 10 or 15 bucks less. However, due to me using like different CRTs, beauty box, CVS manufacturer coupons and force ECBs and um, a manually entered coupons, it lowered it. But anyways, that's beside the point. Um, just wanted to add that little disclaimer in there before, just so you knew that was what happened in my case. So if you can avoid it at all possible, try not to use CVS manufacturer coupons, which would include beauty um, bucks and like force printing ECBs, because that's definitely going to lower your um, percent off coupon. And if anyone knows, like I said, let me know in the um, comments below. So, 47, get back 10, $5.13 moneymaker for three of them, right? So that's a great deal. 
The next scenario I did was pick up three of them at $8.99. I used three $3 manufacturer coupons again, five off 25 CRT. However, this time out of five off of 20 Gillette Mach 3 CRT. So I was able to use that in combination with the five off 25 on this card. I also had a 20% off, so it should have been $2.57. Got back $10, $7.43 moneymaker. Again, this is more like theoretical, hypo, hypo, I can't even talk, um, hypothetical, theoretical, Rhymes. It's a little bit of a mouth twister. Twi twister. Sorry. Um, again, this is all hypothetical. I just put it down when it should have been. But again, because of my fault, what I did, um, it did get messed up. So it's not technically these. However, um, it should be if you follow the deals. Mitchum deodorant, two ninety nine. Get back a one dollar extra buck this week. I believe it's a limit of three. Um, don't quote me on that. Check the ad though. We have a $1 manufacturer coupon and a $1 CRT that I got at least. So it came to 99 cents, got back a dollar. I only picked up one of those. You can probably pick up more if you want to. I had a dollar off five deodorant on another card as well. So you could pick up two of them and they'd just be 49 cents each instead of the free. However, um, just do what you want with those. I just picked up the one. The Purcell laundry detergent is $4.99. And when you buy one, you get a dollar extra buck this week. We have a $2 manufacturer coupon from Red Plum a few weeks ago. However, that coupon expires today, which is Sunday. So hopefully you're able to get that, making it $1.99. I believe it expires today at least. I only had one coupon left. I picked up one of those. Uh, people like those, apparently. Okay, the Tresemme. It's buy one, go one half off. This did not work out the way I planned it on. However, it was eh, so I'm just going to keep them. Um, they're $5.49, and they're buy one, get one half off this week. No extra buck promotion. However, when you scan your card at the red box, they're going to get a 5 off of 3 CRT. We also have a 5 off 3 manufacturer coupon from a Unilever, Unilever insert excuse me, from a couple weeks ago. That is expiring today, Sunday. So it came to $3.72 for 3 or $1.24 each. However, I did have a 2 off of 2 CBS internet printable no longer available, and it was off of any Tresemme or Suave. That coupon did not go through. So hopefully if you were able to do this deal, though, you could use that, and um, it would make them $1.72 for three of them, which would make them a lot cheaper, like 50-something cents each. So that would be a lot better of a deal. However, your cashier would probably have to manually input that through. I don't know if it's a certain order or if... The CRT and the um, IP just don't want to go together because technically, I don't know. I just figured because they were for different amounts of items, maybe you could use them in conjunction. But maybe I had to buy five of them for that to work. So just a heads up on that. The Colgate, um, this was kind of a last minute thing that I did like right before that I noticed in the ad. It's spend 10, get back five. So on one scenario, I did this scenario twice, two different ways. I picked up three Colgate 349. Use three three to three one dollar coupons. Excuse me from the Smart Source 101. I had a dollar off three toothpaste CRT and a thirty percent off CVS coupon. Came to three thirty two and I got back the five. So that was a nice money maker. And then I did it again with the twenty percent coupon. However, I did not have any CRTs on this coupon, so it was five thirty seven and I got back the five. Still not a bad deal. Only about twelve cents a tube of toothpaste. So. I will take it. Um, hopefully, by buying some toothpaste, I will get some further CRTs for those in the future. Next up, Physician's Formula. Physician's Formula this week is spend 12, get back 8. The powder palette here is $15.49. I would not recommend getting this. It is a little more expensive. I wouldn't recommend not because like I'm a beauty guru and I would know, but I'm just saying that because it's more expensive. I had a 5 off of 20 Physician's Formula coupon. I forgot to hand over that coupon because I originally was buying this powder and one of those little makeup removers that were $5.79. So I thought the $5 would come off the other one, making it cheaper, and the 30% off would lower it. And Beauty Club and everything, so I was like, oh, you know, it would be basically the same thing as buying like a regular $12 item. Um... I forgot to use the 5 off 20 coupon, so I returned the makeup remover um, on my way home. So that was that. Um, but after the 30% off, it comes to 1084. And then for this eyeliner here, it's 1179. CBS has a 98% rule. Um, as long as you're within 98% of the required threshold, your extra buck will still print. What that means is it's spend 12, get 8. Your product has to be 98% of $12. 98% of 12 would be about 1176 something like that. And since this was 1179 it just made it, so that did work. So with the 30% off, 
The powder was 1084 with a 20% off. The eyeliner was 943. I had three off of 12 cosmetic CRTs, which made those completely free. A little bit of a moneymaker and beauty club on those. However, like I said, don't um, get this one if you're looking for the best deal. Try to look for a, an 1179 one. I know my stores are higher priced. That's the only reason why this worked. If not, try to find ones that are 1199. I know the ones that are 1199 at other stores were 1299 at my stores. So do what works best for you. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get through this really quickly, and um, I'm kind of stumbling over my words, but. Anyways, I haven't seen anyone talk about this. I saw this on iHeartCVS, so shout out to iHeartCVS. This is a monthly deal. It's the Nuance Salma Hayek um, Cosmetics. It's spend 10, get back 7, which is really good already. It's better than the Physicians and Formula, kind of, if you think about it. Um, and that includes all their products. It's a monthly deal, which ends on the 24th, I believe. Don't quote me on that. Just check the tags in store. It's something like that. It might be the 28th. I'm not sure. Um... I believe it might be the 28th, actually. But anyways, these ones are 1079. They have a variety of different items. I did this on two different cards. It's a limit of four, so technically you could get $40 worth of stuff, get back $28 in extra bucks. If you have any CRTs, personalized coupons, um, email coupons, and beauty club, it's a really good deal. What I ended up doing was using um, a 3 off of 12 cosmetics on one card that I had it on. And since I was picking up the Maybelline, I, I was able to use that. I just applied it towards this, making it $7.79, get back 7 I also had a 30% off, so on one card I used that, and I got, I got let's see, $3.24 off with that. So it was $7.55, and I got back 7 So these are under a buck each with those different scenarios that I did, as well it tracks towards Beauty Club, so not bad. The Zantec, I got the Zantec 150. These are spend $30, get a $10 extra buck this week. They're $10.79. I had 20% off on this card, as well as three $4 manufacturer coupons that can be found on coupons.com. At least those were available yesterday, which is Saturday um, when I'm filming this. So it's $13.89 after all those, and you get back a $10 extra buck, making those $1.29 each. If you don't need them, maybe don't get them unless you know someone who uses them or you want to donate them. Um, my grandma uses them, so I got those for her. Moving along, the Usurin. So I picked up three of the Usurin Intensive Repair 5-ounce um, Rich Feel Lotion. Ooh, Rich Feel. I wonder if you feel rich. Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop. Okay, um, <laughs> the Aquaphor. This is the Aquaphor Advanced Therapy Healing Ointment. It contains two of the 0.35 ounce um lip ointments in there so the lotion was 629 the lip was 649 it's spend twenty dollars get a ten dollar extra buck this week and i had thirty percent off on this card as well i used three three dollar manufacturer coupons for the use run in today's paper as well as one two dollar off coupon for the aquaphor the reason i did this was because i only had three of those three dollar coupons if i could have gotten four of them it would have been a better deal by about a dollar twenty less after all coupons, it was six seventy five. Get back ten. I did notice on one card, I also had a dollar off of a five dollar lotion purchase CRT. However, this was a different card. You can only use CRTs that you get on a certain card, um, specifically for that card. If that makes sense. Sorry if it doesn't. Again, I'm trying to get through this quickly. So that was a money maker. Um, and then the next deal. This is the best deal of the week i would say it's the nexus we don't see a ton of like freebies on the nexus but the nexus this is the 5.1 ounce um homunctorous i'm probably pronouncing that wrong it's the um, two-step conditioner caviar complex very professional anyways it's 11.79 oops sorry 11.79 and when you buy two you get a 12 dollar extra back as advertised in the ad it's actually buy one get Four buy to get twelve. It's printing out a sixteen dollar extra buck, and here is my theory why. It's because when you buy one, you get four. When you buy two, you get twelve. So I think what's how the deal is programmed is if you buy one, you get four. If you buy another one, say later on, you get back twelve. It doesn't you know track a certain way because they probably figured earlier in the week like oh not a ton of people are gonna do the nexus. It's not like you know when they used to do like spend twenty get five png or spend thirty get ten png. So they figured they would just do it like this anyways because it was easier or no one caught it at least. They might fix it later on in the week. Hopefully they don't so you can still get it. But you're going to get a $16 extra buck when you buy two just because the way the deal is programmed within the system. Again, if you want to get this, maybe try to go out there and get it quickly so that way they don't fix it. So they're eleven seventy nine. I had a seven dollars off of a Nexus CRT coupon. I got this on two of my cards. 
as well as I had a four off of eighteen shampoo on this card. Combining it with the excuse me, combining it with the thirty percent off coupon, it came to five fifty. You get back sixteen. That is a huge money maker, almost unheard of in CVS modern couponing times. <laughs> I'm taking AP World History right now. That's why. I'm just thinking randomly like that. But anyways, in modern CVS couponing times, we're going to pretend that's a thing. Um, but that's a $10.50 moneymaker for one deal. Crazy. Last time I was a moneymaker like that, I remember, was the Revlon little single eyeshadows. Anyways, the next scenario I did, I only had a $7 CRT, no percent off, or additional you know, purchase-based CRT. So I came to $16.58, got back $16. Still a great deal for Nexus. These are normally $11.79. These will track towards Beauty Club, so that's um, at least about $2.30 for Beauty Club for doing the deal once. I did it on two cards, like I said. It is a limit of one per card, so keep that in mind. Next up is the Maybelline deal. I only had two manufacturer coupons, which is really sad. Um, so, And it was on the mascara and one of these. So I had to do it a few different scenarios. In one scenario, I got the Maybelline Colossal Mascara at $8.29, and eyeshadow at $4.29. I used a $3 manufacturer coupon for the mascara, $1 on the eyeshadow, $4 CRT, as well as my 30% off coupon. Came to $0.80, cents and I got back a $5 extra buck. Now keep in mind, I also had a 3 off 12 cosmetics. I just applied it towards the Physician's Formula or the Salma Hayek. So, moving along to the next scenario, I picked up two eyeshadows. Excuse me. Sorry for the glare. Um, and my dog's drinking water, if you can hear it in the background. He's a loud drinker. Um, that sounded bad. Not in that way. He's drinking water. <laughs> anyway, so it's $4.29. We have a $4 CRT. Like I said, that printed last week. Hopefully you saved that coupon because it's a better deal this week than if you used it last week. So if you have that coupon still, as well, I had a 20% off on this card. So it came to $2.86. Got back five. Another card I just picked up two at $4.29. I used the $4 coupon. $4.58. Got back five. Still a moneymaker. The Maybelline all tracks towards Beauty Club. Beauty Club is for every $30 you spend, you get a $3 extra buck. It has changed from the spend 50, get five at least currently. Um, I think they're trying to experiment. Um, screen protectors. I just have these randomly because I got these at Dollar Tree. And my screen protector, I always manage to crack my screen protector. And I like to have it on there so I don't crack my screen. I'd rather crack, you know, a piece of glass on top of my screen instead. Um, and I cracked it and I was looking for new ones. Last time I went to Dollar Tree, I could not find them. I found them this time though. So miraculously, I was able to pick those up. Only a buck each compared to like at the Verizon store, it was like 20 bucks or something like that. Ridiculous. They scammed us. You're better off going on Amazon. But if you can find them at Dollar Tree, they're just cheap there. If you don't like mind it, it's probably going to crack within a couple of months. However, you can just replace it with a new one. I got this um, 360 Beauty little lip thing. It's 75% off, making it 74 cents. It was in one of those little displays with all like the Nivea and stuff in them. Moving along, here's another, another, excuse me, really good deal. It's on the Aleve. So these are the Aleve 50 tablet boxes. They are $8.29 at my stores. Buy one, get one half off. I purchased three of them, making it $20.72. And, as, and I had a $3 off of any Aleve CRT, five off a of 20 pain relief CRT. And I used three $2 off coupons in today's paper, which is October 8th, if I believe the date is correct. Um, I also had one that expires today from a while back, but by the time this video is going up, um, you can find $2 coupons in today's inserts that work for those. So it comes to $6.72, and I got back an $8 extra buck. That's a really good deal, um, and even if you don't have the CRTs and you use the product, it might be something you still want to consider. Um, I have someone in my family who uses these, so that's why I picked them up. But if you have the CRTs, the manufacturer coupons, and even if you don't have anyone, it's still a moneymaker, you can donate them. Okay, next deal is the Axe. Axe. Um, I'm going to leave it at there. I picked up two of the body sprays. Those are $5.99, and they're buy one, get one half off this week. I picked up two of the body washes. At $5.79, those are normal price, so I had a 30% coupon which applied towards those. Now, at buy one, go in half off, the body sprays are $5.99 and $2.99. I had a dollar off a $5 deodorant CRT, $2 off a $6 body wash CRT, and I had a buy one body spray, get one body wash free. That coupon, I believe, expires today, sadly. Hopefully, you were able to um, go out, or if this is up and you're, you know, 
you don't go to bed till very late, um, maybe you can still out and get it. Go out and get it still. Um, so my cashier manually took off six forty nine on that, which was awesome. Um, which was the max value. So I ended up paying a dollar ten for four twenty eight cents each. Um, that's a great deal, especially for those type of products. Um, if they don't take off the max value of six forty nine, they should take off five ninety nine. So it would be two ten then. But um, anyways, I thought that was a really good deal. Um, so I picked those up. And I came across that kind of last minute in store. I was originally going to pick up the Nivea for like a buck each with the um, CRT. But then I was like, wait a second. This is an even better deal. So I ended up going with that. Last deal. I know this is a long video. Sorry about that. I talk a lot in the beginning, I just noticed. Um, I did the Scott deal. I believe it's more like Kimberly and Clark. But I got one Pomal of 99 cents. Paper towels are $5.49. Toilet papers are $6.99. Do you call them TP? Do you call them tissue? Do you call them toilet paper? I don't know. Let me know. I don't say tissue. I'm sorry if you say... I feel like tissue is more of like a regional kind of thing to say. I just say toilet paper or TP for short. Um, so I had two $1 off coupons for the Scott toilet paper, two $1 off coupons for the paper towels. Those are regional. Yours might be $0.75. Cents. Where I live, they usually round the coupon up because we double here. Um, sometimes they make it off of two, but luckily this time it was only off of one still. So that was great. Came to seventeen forty six, got back five, twelve forty six out of pocket. Not a great deal at all for toilet paper and paper towels. You can do a lot better. However, since it was a money maker week and I had that percent off coupon, which made it a money maker, I thought, you know what, I'm gonna use some of this money maker to pick up some paper t products. I couldn't think. I I couldn't think if I wanted to say paper towels, toilet paper, or paper products. I ended up going with paper products. Okay, sorry. I bet I'm just confusing you all. That's never my intention. If you ever are confused, just let me know in the comments. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so that was that. I picked up this on Saturday, just a toothbrush, some nail polish, and some candy. I love Reese's. I love Kit Kats, too. I love pretty much all candy. But anyways, like I said, before coupons, all of this stuff would have been $379.37. It's ridiculous to think that just this is like almost $400 worth of stuff. Crazy, I know. Out of pocket, twenty-seven twenty-four. However, I gained a net of twenty-two dollars and fifty cents, or twenty-one dollars and fifty cents. That's wrong. I can't do math. Thirty-two, thirty-one dollars and fifty cents in extra bucks I gained from what I previously had because I did have those nice percent off coupons. So if you combine my out of pocket with my net gain, my overall total for everything was a four dollar. And 26 cent moneymaker. Can I get an amen? Whoop, 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 whoop. Party in the house. All right, I'm recording in the house. I don't know where I was going with that one. But again, this is what I picked up for this week at CBS. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Check me out on Instagram at Couponer Jacob. We're almost at 1,500 followers. It would mean a lot if we got to 1,500 followers, um, you know, by the end of this week on there. That would be awesome. So, again, $4.26 moneymaker. Go out there. If you have a percent off coupon, use it. Come on. There's a lot of great deals you can use it on. And I didn't get, like every single deal this week or like multiples of each deal however i'm happy with what i got um i think i'm pretty much done with the week um i don't know when my next video is going to be sorry about that i am very busy with school and everything going on um so that is that however i will again like i said try to make videos how often i can whether that be you know next week whether that be in a month just know it'll probably at least be in a month because my extra bucks are expiring by then. But hopefully it'll be before then. But if not, thank you all for watching. I will see you all later, the New England Coupon character. Bye! Ow! What was that? Lightning McQueen. Okay, bye.